Hello people, good morning from Dhaka, Bangladesh. Welcome back to our channel. Today I'm doing a couple of reviews. Uh, I have done already an uh, individual review on Calvin Klein D5 Parfum. Check that one out. And I am planning to do a Christmas list for you guys. I know it's early, but these are holiday seasons and everybody's pumped up about, uh, they look forward to this uh, December time. You know, you guys uh, enjoy your holiday. You know, I really wish you happy holidays. And uh, many of you would ask me, do you celebrate Christmas? You know, I get these weird questions from mostly from uh, like my friends from uh, my country or Muslim countries as well as Middle Eastern countries. They're also Muslim countries. They say, do you celebrate Christmas? And I would like to tell everybody, we celebrate life. We celebrate humanity. We celebrate life. You know, like the whole point is to be happy, respect each other. And then, you know, uh, end of the day, we're all human. That's our identification. So I believe if you respect, you know, others and if you have, you know, uh, an open mind, you can learn a lot from other cultures as well. So in our country, luckily in Bangladesh, we have all religions like, uh, like, you know, we celebrate all the festivities, okay, just like Malaysia, and many other countries they do. So Christmas is a very happy time for me. Just let me tell you in short, what is Christmas to me, you know, uh, I feel like, you know, uh, just I, my imagination or vision of Christmas is uh, being in a hotel lobby, you know, like uh, evening time, and you hear low music playing like Christmas carols. And definitely, I, I love, I don't know, many of you hate that Mariah Carey song, All I Want for Christmas is You. <laughs> but there was a movie, uh, there was a, a holiday Christmas theme movie, I think it was uh, Hugh Grant in it. Uh, I forgot the name of the fragrance, uh, not fragrance, movie, but uh, there was a song in there. So I love that song, you know, I, I play it during Christmas. I like those Christmas, uh, like, uh, trees then people do shopping uh, movies like sleepless in seattle great times okay so uh, christmas i'll give you about uh, 10 fragrances and there are many more okay i could have picked my some of my other favorites but these are i these are the ones i really feel gonna be really good suggestion for me from me for you okay try them the first fragrance is a very underrated fragrance i got after many years of searching this is called xenia intenso i have a small little 50 ml bottle and these bottles can be had for 100 uh, 30 50 like these bottle sizes i really find this bottle very very mysterious kind of like a 90s 80s you know uh, time very warm sweet cozy mild spicy fragrance people compare it with code uh, by armani i find this fragrance a little bit different it's a little bit more potent a little bit less vanilla and this fragrance is so nice you know i just love spraying this this fragrance is very very sweet and handsome gentlemanly for dudes you know if you want to stay at home you know you want to make like a romantic time candlelight you know you're cooking this whole thing of uh, christmas this fragrance will be perfect for masculine uh, you know men people who are looking for masculine fragrance this is like the time before uh, like the one you know or nowadays modern fragrance of what your sauvage this is a fragrance that did it back in the days right so zenia intenso that's my number 10 amazing fragrance underrated that's why i put it so following the same trend if you really like uh, sweetness but a little bit of a port wine you guys know what's coming up that's a christmas uh, <laughs> a fan favorite this is a classic i never ever miss out on this fragrance which is my beautiful Burberry's london this fragrance i have a lot of stories check out my review of uh, Burberry's london then you'll see how i got this fragrance for the first time this is a stunning stunning beauty this one has tobacco port wine a little bit of a guava i feel very fruity sweet warm you know uh, cozy fragrance it has great longevity and i really love the fabric on top of the bottle the new versions i think are the same like if not much different uh, their boxes have changed but this is my vintage right so it means older batch you can still get it i mean get it by all means uh, Burberry's london is a fragrance i highly recommend always every christmas this is there it's good for cooking time you know and it goes perfectly with that festivity Next one is a very easy fragrance for me. This is Spice Bomb, uh, Extreme by Victor and Rolf. Uh, you know, winter, this fragrance really, really works in general in cold weathers. This one has spices, vanilla, a little bit of hookah tobacco as described by Steven. And I can really say it, it's a bit dark. The vanilla take on this, it's more a mature version of Spice Bomb for me. It really has great longevity. Some part of the world, it's discontinued. Okay, very hard to find and very expensive. Bangladesh, this particular bottle goes for 100, I think $140 now. But if you look for tester or good deals, you can find it under $85, which is a great value. Spice Bomb by Victor and Rolf, extreme. Really, really, really high class, high-end designer. 
Next one is uh, going to be a little bit up for debate. Some people may say, why not the new one? Why this one? Next fragrance is Lata Vaz Kamra. Take a look at that presentation. I got a backup bottle. I do have my old bottle still running. It's right there. Okay, let me show you my cameras. <laughs> and then obviously the new one is called Lata Vaz Kamra Kawa. Okay, this is the new one. A bit different than them. So why I picked Kamra over Kawa? Kawa has that coffee, kind of like a coffee shop sort of smell, sweetness, you know, a little bit of a gourmand touch it's definitely i like it more than kamra but i tell you why i put kamra uh, instead of kawa today that's of a kamra has that salted you know like a toffee note which i really like and i think christmas time halloween time these are the times when people do buy a lot of candies you know like uh, children they love that and if you love friends you know we lost uh, matthew perry but Friends is going to be always alive with us, those who are a fan of it. So if you remember the Christmas episodes of Friends, uh, you know, they do have uh, those themes, you know, like candies and Monica making jam and all that. Something stuck in my head. This one reminds me of those. Okay, so I am putting Kamra instead of Kamra Kawa because this one is a salted, um, sweet as well, gourmand kind of a fragrance. It's warm, spicy as well. So this one reminds me of Stronger With You by the fireplace angel share kind of fragrances but it has its own identity so definitely it's an affordable fragrance from latafa and very long lasting and it's perfect for winter and if you look at the bottle it just makes sense it's just so beautiful so that's the one that's number seven number six is going to be a little bit of a surprise i got this fragrance you know a few days back and i actually reviewed it long time ago and i do love the men's one but man this one beats the men's one i think both of them are discontinued now but you can get good deals still hugo boss and this is called the scent private accord but this is for women this perfume man if you see the theme similar right uh, this one deserves to be in this spot and i want to give some love to this perfume some of the guys would also appreciate this one has that coffee man that beautiful coffee chocolatey uh not hazelnut but it's more like a how to say butterscotch mixes coffee and a little bit of a floral okay this one is for women definitely gonna be some florals but trust me longevity some people say it's average i got excellent longevity better than the men's one the men's one is a little bit bitter cacao this one is more sweet cacao and then sweet coffee and then florals beautiful beautiful perfume if you never smelled it trust me go to the shop and try it it's gonna be under 40 45 bucks take it okay this one once this is disappeared you know you will have to pay three four hundred bucks for it easily amazing fragrance i think this is one of the surprise entries today for christmas i would highly recommend this if you wear this it's borderline feminine but if you have the confidence go for it hugo boss the scent and this is called private accord for women so now top five <clears throat> festive season let's put a festive fragrance yes le beau le parfum by jean paul jean paul gautier's fragrances are as you can see i have the whole lineup at the back i have more at that side ultra male uh lamal essence de parfum you know regular lamal popayo fresh uh, labo labo mall i have a lot but this one i always think where i'm gonna put this this is so sweet um the original labo which i have an intact backup bottle this is this looks like a bit transparent that one is dark so this one in bangladesh still not very readily available i got it from overseas very expensive uh, so this one amplifies the sweetness this one has that tropical goodness of coconut mango i mean i get a lot of sweetness from it it's very tropical it's very uh like fresh sweet carnival like and some of you may say this is good for summer yes definitely you can take it to the caribbeans but i think in the warm weather it works fine but cool weather this is gonna have been perform better eight to ten hours longevity i'm talking about states and other countries this is really really nice and happy fragrance if you're going to be wearing something in daytime you know uh, receiving guests you know uh, talking to your children you know opening christmas gifts great fragrance okay if you want to give something to your husband keep this in one mind le beau uh, le parfum by jean paul check out my review i really really like that stuff number four azaro back in business azaro uh, wanted the most wanted le parfum too many flankers to remember the names by this perfume is just simple sweet beast mode fruity a little bit warmth to it and uh, maybe particularly like a little bit of a tobacco drawn from the uh, i think 
Azaro uh, Wanted by Night. A little bit of that, but it's more of a sweet fragrance just like it. I like this one a little bit more than that. And if you already have both of these, um, you know, you don't need fragrances like Scandal Le Parfum. If you have Le Beau Le Parfum, you don't need Scandal Le Parfum by. I think that one is from whom? Scandal is from Jean-Paul Gaultier, isn't it? Yes. So, <clears throat> I mean, uh, these are the same kind of same family fragrance. This one is just la longevity is really, really good. Even Beats Le Beau Le Parfum. Check it out. Very beautiful bottle as well. I really like this fragrance. Perfect for cold weather. Definitely deserves a spot in Christmas list. So I have three left. Next one, the very high class fragrance. This is 1821 Sweet Tobacco Spirit Man Made. I love it. I got a backup bottle for a good reason. And this fragrance has great longevity. Very underrated. I think this one, just like uh, Burberry's London, this one has red wine, like a boozy note, tobacco, sweet. Uh, that that mix of honey, red wine, and tobacco makes this fragrance like uh, everything. You know, literally everything you want in a perfume that is sweet, boozy, uh, tobacco, and then honey. This is a fragrance, just beautiful, mouth-watering fragrance, and longevity is through the roofs. I think this is perfect for uh, this time of the year in Christmas. So very high up in the order. But then I am a designer head. You know, you guys know that I do love my designers a lot. I give them a love. And then that's why it beats the next one beats 1821 just because i love it so much this is uh paco Rabanne invictus victory alexa i remember the whole name get a 200 ml of this you know if you love this kind of dna if you love sweet fragrances with like mind-blowing performance man this one gets me compliments left and right the one with the blue base okay this is nicer than any other invictus i did try invictus legend invictus aqua invictus other one the v there are many more platinum and then uh, i think there was one more onyx uh, there's nothing comes close to this okay if you come to in the you know, like a junction like where i'm gonna pick uh, this one versus origin invictus if you ask me i would go for v uh, elixir because it's just so good it's some way similar to labo le perfume i understand because this one also has the mango coconut sort of like a passion uh, creaminess and it's like a dessert but man, this perfume is just wow, <laughs> okay? In Bangladesh, everybody loves this perfume, okay? So if you're a little bit uh, happy kind of person, you want to really enjoy the festivity without any seriousness, try Invictus. And this is called V Elixir, okay? I remember the name. So uh, the last one, and then we'll have one more, and then we'll finish. Last one is Nishan Ezani, okay? This is very obvious, okay? This kind of fragrances are going very obvious because I love honey. If you love fruitiness a little bit of black around citrus sweetness and then you know playful sort of vanilla this is the one nishan azani i do have i believe an older batch with dark juice okay the newer ones i think also good but you have to spray a little bit more because the older ones had more concentration that's what i feel honey is just perfect for um this kind of uh, situation in christmas definitely check it out it's just the best fragrance in this list okay one honorable mention then we'll finish the list one honorable mention is a fragrance you cannot get anymore. Pure Tonka by Thierry Mugler. This perfume is uh, one of those sweet fragrances, has a lot of spice. The Tonka is really amped up. And this fragrance is unapologetic, you know. This one beats many niche fragrance in performance. Some people compare that with Fave Delicious, but I think I like Fave Delicious more. Of course, that's much more expensive. But if you could not afford Fave Delicious, next best thing is this one. One of the best Tonka spicy fragrance like from theory mugler period just longevity is 15 hours plus even if you who like take a nap next day wake up next morning you can smell it on you that good so i think pure tonka makes an excellent christmas fragrance as well so check out these 11 fragrances i believe you're not going to be disappointed but try before you buy okay so once again uh, early uh, christmas and happy holiday wishes for all of you hope you have an excellent time with your friends and family eat well you know uh, celebrate life well and then celebrate the you know being you know in a happy state that's what i feel everything is about happiness if you're not happy nothing seems you know uh, okay in life right so i wish you a bunch of happiness and a bunch of good times and happy holidays to all of you take care have a nice day thanks for watching love you all bye bye